Hello guys, what is up? In this video, we are going to show you how to create breakout rooms in Microsoft Teams. So of course, you need to have Microsoft Teams installed on your PC. Uh, to begin, select Calendar and then New Meeting. Uh, you must be the meeting organizer in order for you to create and manage breakout rooms. So after that, choose a channel to meet uh, in or add students from your class as attendees. After that, you need to create breakout rooms uh, during meeting or you can do it after. But for this example, we're going to create it during the meeting. So join your meeting at its scheduled time and wait for your students to join. After that, when your students have joined and you are ready, select breakout rooms from your meeting controls. Then from the drop down menu, uh, choose how many rooms you'd like to create. Uh, as For this example, it says two, right? Choose if you'd like your students to be assigned to breakout automatically or manually. And then uh, click on create rooms. After that, you can assign participants to rooms. So select assign participants from this window. Uh, organize participants by selecting the, uh, the down arrow next to name or room. After that, group students together to place in a particular breakout room if you want by selecting the check boxes next to their names. Then select the down arrow next to assign and choose a room for them. After this, you just need to repeat these steps and then you select confirm. If you want to rename the room, uh, all you need to do is select your breakout room, then hover over the room and select more options and then rename room. More options is the three dots. After that, type in, uh, type in the new uh, room name and select rename room. If you want to set a time limit for the breakout sessions, uh, in the meeting control, select breakout room and select room settings, uh, the cogwheel, then select a set, a, uh, set a time limit, then select the down arrow and choose a se uh, session length. Then when you're done, select the back button to save your changes. And when you want to set out, uh, start your breakout rooms, uh, just select breakout room and then hover over the room that you want to, you know, start and, you know, click on more options and then open room. And to start rooms all at once, just select open and you will be good to go. So that's pretty much it. That's the video. Hope you liked it. Like, comment, share, subscribe, ring that bell icon. I'll see you on the next video.